one of the things I'm often asked about is when it comes to updating text within the Joomla website. And here we've got a particular Joomla website which has got some text on which we need to change. Now this text here is actually going to come from Microsoft Word. Now, I often tell people you are not allowed to cut and paste directly this type of text from Microsoft Word because Microsoft Word will carry in all sorts of weird format and, and make the text look really odd. So you actually need to do it in a two-part process. The first thing you need to do is find the article that you want to change. So here I've logged into the Joomla admin area, as you can see. I've went to the article manager and I've searched for this article on the subject of latrines. So I'll just go in and start editing that particular article. And you can see here we've got some text. Now we want to replace this text. Now the temptation is to copy from Word straight in to this area because it kind of looks like Microsoft Word because it's got this nice toolbar along the top here but it's a website so it's not the same as Microsoft Word and when you copy and paste it it'll mess the whole format in the page up. So what you need to do is get your text from Microsoft Word and copy it. Once you've done that you can go to your desktop it's my standard desktop here on uh, uh, Microsoft Windows click anywhere in where there's space and go to new and then down here, you'll find text document. Choose this option. And what it'll do is create a new text document. We'll just call this latrines, since that's where the uh, text that we're placing in there is on the topic of. You then double click it to open it up, and you can see here we've got a fresh document. Now, the, the beauty with this do text document is it's got no format whatsoever, so it's safe to paste the content into. Once you paste the content in, it'll look something like this. And you can see it's very um, basic, there's no format whatsoever. Once you've pasted it in, you then choose Edit Select All to select all the text. Then Edit Copy to copy it. You then go back to the article and you can then paste that in. Now the best way of pasting it in is using the keyboard shortcut which I can't actually show you on the screen but it's pressing Control and V together and what that does is uh, the shortcut keys for paste. Um, if you use the right mouse button within here sometimes that doesn't work. Now the first thing you'll notice is that the text isn't formatted, so the word latrines here was previously in a headline font. If I quickly flip back, you can see here that it's written in black. The text underneath is written in blue and is slightly smaller. Now this is controlled uh, through the heading styles. So what you do is you choose the word that you want to change and then up here, you choose the font style that you want it to be. So in this case, the black main heading at the top of a page is heading one. You can see now it is that gray color. Now, if you wanted to make this the blue text, the same as it says down here where it says project details, you simply choose heading style two. Similarly, if there's a piece of text that you want to make bold, you choose the bold tag or italic. So everything is controlled using these buttons here. So you need to make sure that the text comes in very, very basically, plain, no formatting, and you use these tools that are along the top in the toolbar here to control how the page looks. I'm just going to delete this extra space here. There we go. And I'll just make this headline 1. If I click off that, you can see it's grey. I just need to save that article. And that's the task done. Simple as that. So that's how you go about changing the text.
taking it from Word and placing it inside a document. Thanks for watching.